Hi, happy launch day. It is the first launch day ever for Rewind Collective, my lifestyle brand, and I am absolutely ecstatic. My name is Lauren. If you are new here, I am so glad you are joining on this exciting day. I am a 26 year old entrepreneur based out of Atlanta, Georgia, and today I am launching my second business ever. It is called Rewind Collective. It is a lifestyle brand. And if you'd like to check it out, it'll be linked below and all the socials will be below as well. I am going to be showing you the ups and downs of launching a brand new business. So I am going to be transparent whether I get zero orders today or I get 10 orders today. I'm going to be transparent and tell you because I want to show the real life of launching a business and not just what you see online, which is kind of the very typical viral brand and you get thousands of orders a day that's honestly just not super realistic from what i've learned with my first business so as this is my second business i would love to have you join me on this journey and see more behind the scenes and truly the ups and downs of this experience and we're going to go through it and learn a lot together this is my first time using shopify so i'm a little bit extra nervous but fingers crossed it all runs smoothly Today we are going to go through my email marketing, my social posts, and all of my products on Shopify to make sure at 2 p.m. everything goes to plan, products go live, customers can see everything, all the info is on the website, and we can just hopefully have a really exciting afternoon together. But anyways, I guess we should get to work because it's already about 10 a.m. I've made a couple TikToks this morning, went to the gym, did all my morning activities and now we really need to dive into this. Let's get to work. Iced coffee is made and that means that I'm ready to dive into my work. I do have my computer here. We're just sitting at my little desk and first thing I need to do is go over some email and messages for my first business which is Nomad Candy. It is a rave and accessory business so still need to take care of some things on that end of course so I'm going to knock that out first thing. So the rest of the day, I can really focus in on Rewind Collective. I just took care of those emails and messages, and now it is almost 11 o'clock, a little bit before then. We are going to make a few Canva graphics that I'll use to promote on my story throughout the weekend of new products that launched. And then I also need to start going through all my Shopify products, and I'll give you a little tour behind the scenes of how the site will look when it launches, which is like three hours away now. Whew, okay, we got this. Now time to look over my email marketing. I have a launch date email that is scheduled to go out out about 2 p.m. to anybody that's signed up over the past week. They will receive this email as a reminder that the launch is officially live, our first launch ever, and it includes a 10% off coupon. This is my first time doing email marketing. <laughs> it's been a long time coming and I am very excited to be learning about this. So we're gonna be doing some experimenting here in the first few months, I'm sure, and getting the hang of it. But we're just hoping that today this email goes out as scheduled and it's eye-catching and people like it and it's fun and it really represents Rewind Collective as a whole. So let's look over it. I am using Privy. It's P-R-I-V-Y. Not 100% sure I'm saying it right, but one of my friends who also runs a business suggested this. So this is what I'm using for now. It linked very easily with Shopify, which I love. And I think it's actually Shopify's number one suggested email marketing company. So that worked out for me. <laughs> Um, I will go through the launch email right now and show you what will be going out. Here is the launch day email. It is scheduled for the 9th and I know it's going out at 2 p.m. Now this is just my logo graphic. The subject line will be Rewind Collective first launch ever. This graphic right here, so this whole purple part, I actually did make this on Adobe Illustrator because I wanted to use my little sparkles the font that I love and my smiles that are part of my branding as well. But you could definitely just make this on Canva or use one of their automations or templates that they have here on Privy. 
this is the shop now button that will take you right to the shop and then here is the 10 percent off is going to be active for the first 48 hours and the code of course then i added some featured products these are just things that i think people would love and they're eye-catching they're fun they have their little names under them and then i think this is the coolest part i could add my own youtube video so i added the launching my second business that little intro video if you haven't watched it yet definitely go back after this one and watch it it's just a very short intro of rewind collective and i gave some sneak peeks and then of course at the bottom i have rewind collectives tiktok instagram and pinterest that will all be linked as well i can also show you um oh angel number wait i love that my sign up rate is 4444 right now. That's so cute. <laughs> Obviously, most of my numbers are zero right now because nothing has gone live yet. So, over time, this will, of course, go up. The great part about Privy to me is that it easily links with Shopify, like I said. So, anybody that signed up on my Shopify is automatically imported into my contacts here on Privy. I'm not going to show you the email addresses, of course but I love that everything is automatically linked. That just makes it one less thing that I need to do myself. Now we do need to start going through all of these products and making sure everything's good to go. Everything says active right now that will be going live today. I have a few drafts for some other incoming items over the next couple of weeks, but let's get started on going through these. I just went through and checked all of my product listings, descriptions, and everything like that. Everything looks good on my end. So now I'm going to give you a little walkthrough of how my Shopify will look today when it launches. At 2 p.m., I'm going to remove the password. It will launch and everything will become available. We are one hour and 50 minutes away from the launch. Okay, let's. I'll show you the Shopify now. next four to five launches already planned so that is super exciting i will say for nomad candy that was not something i was always doing in the beginning it is something i've gotten into over the past year as i've grown which is just really planning and being prepared ahead of time instead of during launch week like trying to prep everything as fast as possible and it gets super stressful so with rewind collective i have already planned my first like four to five launches i have all the sample items already i've been photographing things and it just gives me a little more time a little more leeway and of course i want to see the samples make sure everything is up to par and what i expected to be giving my customers now i'm going to pull up my content calendar and i'm going to go ahead and go in my notes and write the caption for today's reel that will be going up at 2 p.m. when it launches. This is my content calendar for Rewind Collective. So obviously we're in March. I'm a very visual person, so having this is super helpful. Shout out to my friend Jackie that created this and then sent me a copy of it. But basically I've just been going through and writing down what each graphic will be each day, each post, or what we're talking about on our stories. And then I've been going through with light purple, which is my brand color as kind of like the completion. So when that post is done, it's uploaded, I go ahead and mark it as purple because it just visually helps me see what I am doing. Image, And then on here, I've been getting into more of the details and I actually ended up changing some of this, but I'm going to go ahead and go through this again over the weekend. This has very much been an experiment so far this week as my first week, but you can kind of see I have some graphics laid out to launch some days. I have new collections. And then when it gets to the other months, I will continue duplicating this and updating it. I have other launches written down. And again, it's just a visual representation of what I am planning to post. Since this is my own business, I can be flexible and change things around when I see fit. Planning my posts on Google Sheets and Canva just helps me to make sure I am staying up to date, I am 
getting things that I want posted out there because a lot of times I do make a lot of content as somebody who is a content creator for so long. I am great at making tons of content, but then a lot of times that content will just sit in a folder and nobody ever sees it because I pick like maybe one or two things that I think are the very best. So this helps me spread out my contact content, make sure all different socials are getting different mix of things. And it's just getting out there into the world since we work so hard to make content, it's important to also work on our planning and scheduling of those posts. Charlie, say hi YouTube. We're ready for the launch. Oh. We are 15 minutes away. I just was petting Charlie for some emotional support because I'm super nervous. Um, I need to make my Instagram post go live because I don't have anything scheduled yet for Rewind. I just don't have later set up for this business yet. And then I need to take the password off my site and hopefully people get on and I'm going to show you the whole thing. I decided to set three little goals for today. So we're going to try to hit 75 email subscribers, 10 orders, sales, whatever you want to call it, and 250 site visitors. I'm really excited because Etsy does not show you all the things that Shopify does. So for the first time ever, I get to see the globe and like where people are shopping from and on the site. And I'm super excited about that because I always watch other vlogs where you get to see that and I've always wanted to be able to see that. So you're going to see in 13 minutes. It's 1.59, so I'm going to remove the password. Three, two, one. There we go. Okay. Okay. It's open to everyone. Your store is no longer restricted. Here is the Shopify map. So it's exactly 2 p.m. Oh, this is so cool. You can see people opening the site and the amount of visitors right now. Oh my gosh. Ah! <laughs> I think we're good. I think we're good. We have 11 visitors. 12 visitors. This is so cool. I also have a time lapse going, so my iPad will have a little time lapse of the map and everything. Seriously, I'm having a launch. But yeah, okay, so you can see everything, I think. <laughs> uh, guys, we got our first order. We got, we got our first sale. Ah! Um, but here is, I think this is just so cool. You can zoom in and see where people are visiting from and like i said etsy doesn't have anything like this so i've always wanted to be able to see this oh my gosh that's amazing i'm just kind of staring at this because i'm excited and i don't really have anything else to do technically right now um since i already posted and i will go back on there and make sure i don't have any messages or questions and stuff but as of right now i just kind of get to watch the live the oh, we got another sale See, that's what I mean when people say like shopping small means so much to people like like me as you just saw how excited I got over getting another order like it just it means the world to know that people support your dreams and your mission and I just can never say thank you enough so thank you so much if you've been watching or supporting in any way and as always support is not just purchases like shares and comments reviews and sending things to your friends means so much and Oh my gosh, I'm just so excited. Ah, we got another order. Of course, when I clicked out of it, we got an order. <laughs> now that we have three orders, that means we are 33.33333333% to our order goal for the day. We did it. We launched. We got our first three orders ever, and I can't believe it. I stopped recording because they are hammering so loud, literally right above me. And in that moment, I got three sales. <laughs> Go figure. So we're up to six orders. We're more than halfway to the goal. And oh my goodness, I'm just so excited. I think this hoodie might be the best seller right now. Uh, it's this or the cosmic um, pants, but oh my goodness, I'm just so grateful. We are officially about an hour and a half into the launch and we are at nine total orders, which means we are one away from the launch goal. So, so excited. Um, I am 
just trying to go back to work now. Um, you probably saw me set up a little abandoned cart email because I still needed to edit that. It was something that I prioritized to do after the launch because I had started it and um, I just wasn't looking how I wanted it to. So I decided to take a break from it last night and I knew today I could work on it since that email won't even start going out until a few hours after somebody abandons their cart. So the hope is that it will capture somebody back in if they added things to their cart and then they got distracted or they decided maybe not right now, but I give them a little coupon and maybe they will come back. That is the hope at least. Um, but again, we are one order away from the order goal. <laughs> I was about to turn off my time lapse, but we just did it. We hit 10 orders. That is the launch goal. Oh man, I'm so excited and so proud. Here is my computer. Hopefully my iPad caught that because I kept missing when I would get an order, but so amazing. We have 10 orders for the day. Oh, I'm just so proud and so thankful. So when I first was considering what my goal should be for the day, I was going to set it as five orders, but I decided to do a little bit more of a reach and do 10. And I know that probably doesn't sound like a ton to a lot of people, but as a brand that just started out, that is a lot of orders. And I'm just so proud that we hit that today and I can't wait to see where this weekend takes us. I will go ahead and probably kind of finish out this vlog right here for now because I am going to go prep some stuff for dinner, take Charlie on a walk, and then we are going to Florida for the weekend. So I need to pack because I haven't done any of that all day, but I'm going to update this at least one more time later this evening, give you any more updates, see how we did with those other goals that I set as well, and just kind of round out this launch day. <laughs> It is a few days later and I wanted to give you the updates of how the first launch ever went for Rewind Collective. So my three goals, my first one was 75 email subscribers and I hit 78. So we had three more than the goal, which is awesome. And then my order goal was for 10 orders to be placed and I received 14 orders. So grateful. That was so exciting. And then I wanted to hit 250 visitors on Shopify and I ended up hitting 315 visitors. So we hit every goal just a little bit over each one. So I think that they were set pretty well considering that I hit each one and I did kind of estimate pretty close as to what I expected how the launch would go. So super exciting. I would love for you to check it out below. And of course, all the socials will be linked for Rewind Collective as well. We have another launch coming up this Friday. It is the Angel Numbers Collection. So that'll be right around when this video goes live. And I have so many exciting things planned. Thank you so much for joining me. I hope you loved seeing the behind the scenes and the true emotions behind a business launch. If you enjoyed this, be sure to leave a comment and like, and let me know if you'd like to see more launch day vlogs in the future. Thanks so much for joining. Bye.